Caught me and a bunch of others on a Plugat roundup. Plugats are what the Frowls called us then. That's a Frowl. They ran everything. And that's me, Gruss, a prisoner in the comb of the Frisco. Their ruler, the Tiara. She was giving us hot scan, deciding what she was going to do with us. I didn't need heavy smarts to figure things were going cold naked. That means very bad. Cedar. Macho. Macho. The Frowls called macho. their slaves machos. They did all the hard work. Macho. Sure wasn't something I wanted to do. Cedar, Machos, Market. Cedars were for one thing and one thing only, making baby frogs. Tierra had picked Corvus out for her own daughter, Vina. Take much to get the frogs. The least little thing would set them off. I was not scanning for a way out. I decided to take the first offer that came along. For the old radiation. The Frowls call it the contents. We didn't know what we'd find there. But we knew one thing. They wouldn't follow us inside. It was against their rage, their rules.
It was cold heart. But we survived. One day, Corvus and me were scrounging for something we could use. What we found would change our world forever. Uh, not the hat. The book. Determined to free ourselves from the frowns, we banded together in the contents. We built our own comb out of pieces of a Newt Mercan's base called Camp Reagan. I never did figure out what a Reagan was. the frogs, all men were blue guys. But there was a difference between these hairy beasts and us. They were dumb and hungry. Really dumb. And really hungry. There was naked such thing as a free lunch. Yeah. You got what you worked for. Snapped and dash. You got 
started scurrying. But not soon enough. Meanwhile, back at the comb, things were going on as usual. Lakella, the Tierra's second, or next in line, was sharpening up her axe. Thrall was taking her final warrior's test. Trying to survive a meeting with Arg the Awful. Fallout from the great new force Arg to take a detour from the human race. The fun was Shannon. He was Nagy gonna find a way back. What had happened to us, dear toys, if anything happens to the tiara? to take us from the past into a new life. It was my dream, make it yours. Vina, my daughter. You, the Tierra. Thank you, Rhea. I'm not the woman. You are now. Listen. In my shelter, a map. Follow it. Rhea, please. I don't want to be Tiara. Cold. Sister? I serve the Tierra. Hot. Well, the Frows were weeping. Corvus and me were scrounging. Scan like some tasty leftovers. for the weps. Corvus went for the eats. He found more than he bargained for.
Amy. Amy was an escaped toy. Frowls kept them as pets, called them toys. To make plastic sure they'd stay quiet, they cut off their tongues. To keep them gentle, they cut off something else. Kella, second to Vina, Tiara of Frisco, give you safe shelter. I, Freha, second to Moha, Tiara of Kansas, accept your safe shelter. Hot surprise, eh, La Kella? Your sister be in Tiara, not you. We Kansas figured you for it. Rhea's choice, Tiara Moha. You go with it? It's done. You can always challenge Lakella. Hmm? The party will be soon, Tiara Morha. Well, oh, Lakella's pissed at her sister being Tiara, huh? Maybe something for us cancels in this. Tiara. Negi miss it, Vina. Lots to talk about. Today's for partying, not for talking. Plenty of time for both, Vina. Once the world was green and living. Then was the great nuke. Death lived everywhere. All were born sick and unclean. A living curse from the Americans and commies. Then one day, a baby was born. Clean and clear. And the living curse was over. The child grew strong and beautiful. And she was called... Woman! Woman taught her children to follow the tiara and obey the regs. And the earth lived again. But some disobeyed the regs. And from them came the children of darkness and disease. <laughs> Blue gods to be hunted and nuked till Negi are left. Vina of Frisco. Solemn swear to enforce the regs, oversee the burthen, and rule the comb till the president comes to lead us into new tomorrow. Solemn swear.
Trowels were having a hot time. But we were getting ready to give them a hot time of our own. Frawls, hot party and getting all loose and wagoed. Effing Frawls. Nuke them all. Naked Gross, nuking Frawls gets us nothing but nuked Frawls. But we burn their food shelves, free the machos, Frawls will starve. It was kind of hide and seek and makes me feel cold. Well, you gotta get hot on new ways, Gross. We're gonna be better than the Frawls. We waited a long, cold time. Now we said it right. Negging more machos. Negging more toys. Negging more cedars. Negging more cedars. Just men. How do you figure it, Tiara? Well, Vina ain't Rhea. She's weak, huh? <laughs> and her sister, Lakella, wants to be Tiara. <laughs> yeah, a little push here. A little rumor there for that. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Soon they'll be fighting each other like blue guts in heat. Huh? <laughs> and I'll pick up the pieces, huh? The map of the contams. Rhea's last wish. I got negative choice. Well, be careful, Zena. Just because you're tiara doesn't mean you can break the regs. If Lakella finds you going there, she'll death challenge you for sure. Don't worry, Linka. I'll be careful. And I got you on my side. Not much longer. My season's here. Your season? Why goes when? Oh, day next. Uh, being TR is easy next to Seedon. Seedon's a cold act. But it's got to be done. Well, I'll be there for the birth in Lincoln. So I'm swear. Thanks, Vina. And don't worry about being Tiara. I know you're going to be number one. Real hot. Let's go. This may be Wagos. Great time to think of it. Corvus knew just how to create confidence in his men. He was a born leader.
expected the Machos to greet us with open arms. We were wrong. <laughs> I'm getting caught. Stealing from the frost was hard work. I needed something to cool me off. I needed some more. I'm Corvus. I'm a free man. You're machos, slaves. You like crap eats? You like being beaten? Treated like beasts? We're offering freedom. Make more beatings. Make more macho pits. Freedom. Scan it. You hungry? We got hot eats. There's plenty more where that came from. Rawls took his tongue, not his head. Who's next? Everything was going hot plastic. Until... Come out of there! I won't leave any man behind. Effort, Wagos! It was downhill from there. <laughs> My break was over. What? Time to get back to work. Tax plastic for us. Huh? <laughs> what I call for a union with the Friscos, they'll jump at it. <laughs> we'll get rid of Eva, put in La Kelle, and I'll be riding high. Jump. 
Joseph and Browns are gonna catch us damn soon. Gross, you get the men safe to camp. I'm gonna lead those Friscos into the contest. Let me go with. Thank you, Gross. This is my screw up. Another horse will make more dust. Check. I'll take your horse too. Stop it! <laughs> Russ, if they nuke me, you're number one. Never happened. That's what I was saying, but not what I was feeling. On your own. There's only one rider here. Plugot tricked me. Plugot's got neggy smarts for tricking nobody, Vina. Tell that to the Plugot, Lakella. not turning out to be one of Corvus's hotter days. It scanned like the end for Corvus. I would have been weeping and wailing for my friend and leader. Except for one little thing. moment on, I gained a new respect for the written word. Now all Corvus had to do was get out of there, wherever there was.
New book. You're cold quiet. Go back to the comb without me. Where's to trot here, Tierra? I just need some time alone, Lakella. Be careful, Tierra. I'll be. President, Mr. President. President? Where's the president? Where's the president? This is General Greer on board Looking Glass. President? It now appears, sir, that the NORAD warning computers reporting a massive Soviet first strike were in error, and that negative Soviet or Warsaw Pact missiles were fired first. Talking pictures, Wago is naked president here? Just Corvus. However, in compliance with standing presidential orders, our computers initiated a total retaliatory response. All, I repeat all, land and sea-based ICBMs and all, repeat all, cruise missiles have been launched. At 0300 hours, 
warning satellites confirmed. Repeat, confirmed. A Soviet counter-strike. Mr. President, I know I can speak for all of us when I say we didn't ask for this war. But God damn, Mr. President, we've won it. Caught the Ruskies with their pants down. Now it's up to you, sir, to lead us into a new tomorrow. Goodbye and good luck, Mr. President. Vina was following the late Tierra's last wish. What she was going to discover inside that cave changed the way things were supposed to go. For the Frawls and us. Lels was desperate. He'd gone to the very edge of the Contam searching for his missing toys. They were safe with us, starting a new life. Ricky! Dub! Mickey! Where are you, little toys? It's Lels! Keeper. Nagy hurt president. Nagy hurt, please. Let us do anything, great and powerful president. Anything, just don't hurt me. Please. Oh, oh I believe. I believe the legend, great and powerful president. I believe. I scanned one day you'd come and, and, and lead us to new tomorrow. And, and now you're here. Oh, I believe, president. I believe. Ah! Got a name, half frog? Les, oh great and powerful president. Les, the toy keeper. Not anymore. Nagy more toys, Nagy more machos. Nagy more toys. Oh, that's cold act for Les. Very cold act. What'll I do? President gonna free all men from frogs. 
Lels helps, the president will help Lels. But if Lels hurts... Lels are hurt, Lels are hurt. A great and powerful president Let's know all about the Coons. So? Uh, ask Auntie Aravina, the new Tia Aravina, worried about proving herself. And Tia of Kansas wanted to be Tia of Frisco. And Vina's house friend Linka been seated. Seated? Seated. And this uh, Linka hot tight with Vina? Plastic hot great one from the time they were small. President let Lels live. For now. But if Lels talks about scanning president. My mouth shut plastic tight. Solemn swear. Solemn swear. Check, check. I'll trot it out of here. <laughs> oh! Your cart. President Maggie needed. Puss. Sorry. <laughs> her. Don't know. Well, I better be damn hot making me wait like a macho. Vina found what she went looking for. She couldn't wait to scan more high La Kella her new plaything. Except dear La Kella knew about it already. Ah! Let's from the Merkins. Not the Merkins, Morha. I made them. We're going to use these thunder rocks against the Plugats. You broke the rigs. You'll bring the curse on us. It's me you're fearing, Morha, huh? not the curse. No! Tiara of Canso fears Mege woman. Back at Camp Reagan, we were trying to turn the machos into men. We had a long way to go. I'm getting cold worried, Gress. Corver should have been here right now. I know. And just what do we do with that arg thing? Arg. It won't go away and it smells cold. Oh. Oh. What's it, Ralph? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. 
We're going to learn how to use these American things. Corvus, uh, try this. It tastes cold lago, so it makes you feel hot plastic. Yeah, great. you men to knock out the Frisco Cedar camp. Cedars? That sounds wild to me. You said you're gonna starve them. Now, but scan this. The Tierra's hottest friend, Link, is being seated now. If we can grab her, maybe we can trade her for a talk. We save men some hard nuking. Now, how you scan that? Now, there was this uh, half frawl Lels, the Frisco's toy keeper. He scanned me for president. He was fearing I was gonna nuke him, so I hot talking. Corpus is a president. Wagos, huh? Yeah, that's Wagos. <laughs> Would a Tierra talk to you? Maybe not with Corvus. But she'd have to with the president. like toys? Trog nuked himself with American whips, can it? Trog did this. Neggy spirits, neggy curse. Just Trog screw up. Corvus hotter than man. Corvus is the president. The president has given Gruss new power, new ways of scanning. And plastic! Follow the president! Follow the president! Follow the president! The president! Follow the president! Follow the president! Follow the president! Follow the president! You'll stay here while you're getting bigger. After the birth, and we raise her. I scanned that. But Eggy fear, Link, uh, we've picked a clean cedar for you. It knows what to do and how to do it. Check, check. In the time of the Mercans and Commies, this place was called Paradise Oil and Gas. It's where the frowls made little frowls. But if they had a boy, cold day, they threw him away like last year's eats. Just lie down and close your eyes. It'll be all right, Linka. You're not the first woman to get seated.
de guías. Oh, Linka. Linka! Jack. Hot. Take off those prowl rags, Cedar. You're free now. If you want it. In a short time, we learned to use those Americans things, and Amy got a bright idea. The spirit of the president speaks. The president is here, now. Hot scan what I say. Tiaro Frisco, you will meet the president alone. At High Sun, go to the edge of the contams. There you'll find your friend, Lincoln, safe and unhurt. But if you disobey, and the president will cold nuke all combs, just like the Americans and commies. Tiara of Frisco, time's now to change your world, or end it. It's a trick. It's a cold Plugat trick. Since when Plugat sharp enough for tricks like that, Morha? When the president comes, she'll be like me. A cancerous. Never Plugat. Legends don't say what the president will scan like. If talking with this spirit gets Linka back, damn right I'll talk. Rhea never would have. Rhea's cold, Lakella. I'm the tiara. Then act like a tiara. Fight. Nuke the Plugats.
Negi, I'm gonna follow the President's command. So, your tiara is gonna talk to a Plugat spirit, huh? Wouldn't be happening if you were the tiara. But I'm not. Could be. A victory against the Plugats. That would show your comb who the real leader is, huh? And with me behind you, oh, you'd be more powerful than Rhea ever was. Just one thing you need, huh? What's it? Thunder Rock. Easy. I know just where to get them. Oh. You're sounding like a leader already. Tiara. Prowl coming. Well? Clean as a frog. I was hoping for more than that. Tiara of Frisco. Corvus, the president. Where's Linka? What Prezi says. Prezi does. worried you were cold. Or worse. Oh, Vina. I never figured scanning you again. I'm okay, Tiara. Nobody hurt me. You go. Go in, Mika. And keep Lakella out of trouble. I've got something special for Tierra's eyes only. What's it? Listen, nothing cold's gonna happen to you. You got the Prezi's word on it. Solemn swear. Hmm. Solemn swear. up trouble. Huh. Something's cold here. Tiara Venus said Negi about attacking the Plukats. Check, check. Tell again before battle. Tiara's got to tell you two, Negi. Huh? If you're worried about fighting the Plugats, you stay here with the ground. It's you and Lakella we're worried about, not the Plugats. <laughs> Save your heat, the Plugats.
gotta tell president. Hans gun cold. Nagy, nagy. Gotta tell Frizz. Lel! Freeze it! What are you gonna... Women of Frisco. Are you ready to finish off these macho steel and comb burning plugats? Yes. What are we gonna do? Okay, hot Prezi. Now what? President wants light! Careful. Don't want to nuke the world. Prezi's got more to show to you. Just one of the president's games. The comb of the mayor cans. Wow. I, I've never scanned anything like this before. Prezi shelved only thing like this anywhere. How come Prezi's scanning all this to me? Frau's still fearing, Prezi? Stop calling me Frau. I'm woman. Me? Don't know. Maybe spirit. Maybe Plugat. Maybe Plugat. You. Put it away. If I wanted to pain you, I wouldn't have brought you here. H how come you did? To talk. <laughs> Bowed. Man and woman. Man? What's it, man? She was gonna find out. I am a man. Negi Macho. Negi Toy. Cedar. Man. Feel. Flesh like Venus. Heartbeats like Venus. Eyes, ears, just like Venus. Corvus's ABC book didn't cover this sort of thing. Two leaders had to uh, feel their way along.
Buonasera, amico. Corvus talks, Bras attack, and men get nuked again. Where's Corvus? He had his hands full with high-level negotiations. They had reached a delicate stage. Not a fighter. You better hide now. Amy! This will be a cold surprise for the Frowns. And they had a couple cold surprises for us.
by yourself, Prowl. Time comes now for new tomorrow. Negi, sisters of Frisco. Just super toy keeper. Wells was still trying to get to the president. The man was motivated. What's it, Wells? What happened? The Aravina. Talking with great one, like Helen Moore, attacked Flugert. While you were talking, the friends were nuking. Vina told me lies. Cold damn lies. Rest. Let's get the horses. Revenge, Corvus. Take it. I won't stop you. Revenge? Not hot enough for you. Talking new tomorrow and doing what Frawl's always done, nuking and painting. You were tricked, and so was I. But it'll never happen again. Solemn swear. I've been right, it won't.
this is what you want? More nuking? More biting? Your choice, Corbis. What's it gonna be? what Vina and Corvus were doing. The harder we scanned, the hotter it looked. Maybe there was something men and women could do with each other's sides, fighting and nuking. I was gonna find out. Okay. 